this reply. I want to put a summary report. Uh, we tell the government of National Highway, it acknowledges that there is a slackness, complacence on the part of uh, Elisha this year and executing the country report of National Highway 29. If the government acknowledges what kind of action you are contemplating to take under the National yeah. Highway law, as mentioned, the then Honorable Prime Minister Vaspaji Kirtun Nanglen in October 2003, <coughs> when I took over as him, he was very kind and all of his thousand plus financial package, whole land from Zinor to Bohemia was committed. Unfortunately, BGP led government by Vaspaji lost the Lok Sabha election in 2004. And this national highway was declaring was came in the cool storage. When the UPA 1 and UPA 2 came to power at the center. Also the others, other commitments were also not sanctioned. <coughs> Only when the GP then government NDA came to power of the UPA 1 and 2, the commitment started around 2015-16. And very unfortunate that we face these two blockages, one during UPA 1 and 2, and when this commitment was started, again, we are happy, <coughs> we are extremely happy that NHI this year could come. There the government of India, UPSU, PSU, is the agent of the central government. We thought they will do a good job. But when the other day, when I met the MRTH minister, Nitin Gadkari, by coming, he summoned the NHIDC people in his room. And as I entered, I greeted him, good morning, sir. He said, good morning, Rio. I'm told you had filed criminal case against my people, I say yes, because they are doing horrible jobs. And then his other sentence was, good, you fight. Issue warrant of arrest, non bailable That is the command of the Indian Home Minister. And all the officials were there. Then we start discussing. And they admit their failures. And in Pagla Bahar area, exactly after one year, the completion, the road was stopped. We were using one land. The whole year, and exactly after one year, another rockfall came and hit the car. So, the state government, after we had meeting with the department, we decided that we will file a criminal case, if I are, and we registered. And that's how the case is going on. It is very serious. In other states also, 
the state is fighting case against them because they have not done a good job. In that meeting, we did in Kathkari, my last visit, the NHIDCL said we could not foresee the soil condition, the nature of topography and the formation. So we have decided to deploy a scientific study, a consultancy, but this process will take one year. So, even present this phase three, much light that is coming, our land owners are abstracting boulders wherever it is. And the base, all the rock formation is taken out. And then in that, another digging for expansion of roads first, base, to four land road, it is done. But you all have seen, in that CC concrete retaining walls also, they have not put a single MS road. And when the weight comes, the concrete wall is just breaking and falling. Because there is nothing to hold, there is no base, and the CC wall has no iron rods. What technology? What engineering? So, after our many meetings, they started using MS road for the concrete walls. But I don't know how good is the base and whether they are putting the wings. Otherwise, it can not carry the load. And they started all this again during the monsoon. That's why it is a mess. And human being, we have limitation to fight against the natural course of calamities. It is very unfortunate. And honorable members raising zero are raising questions they have totally failed how many years the road to Zenoboto faced the problem Air cutting was done and then it did not do the road properly mudslides continued then even road to Mon even road to Longland, all this we had wasted for five years. Somehow it has improved a little bit. And therefore, the NHID seal, their commitment in front of Union Home, uh, Union Home Minister, uh, Union uh, MRTH Minister, we hope that NHID seal will do scientifically scientific study and the consultancy to do how the road should be built. Meanwhile, in Pakra Bahar, the PWD department that had made a bypass road from all, all the Nichagar gate going up the hills and coming down in New Chomkadima. So, by this season, that will be pliable. But up here, just a small stretch from Padutsa to Zubza River, on the other side, up to National Highway 61, is good. It's two lane and comfortably vehicles are flying. Therefore, I think National Highway agencies and the state PWD should coordinate so that where it is possible immediately it should be done so that people do not face such hazardous and I hope this time the Chinese will, will do but I fully agree if 
their is needs to file another IFR, file case against them, be in HIDCL or be even the firms who are doing the work, if they are lacking. Admitting their failures in the government reply. And if they don't give their commitment, they have given commitment to me also a lot of time, they fail miserably.